Hey guys, welcome to the Battlefield 5 beta. This is on the PS4. Um, this game is available in beta format from the 7th till the 11th, I believe. So it's over, over the course of five days. I've downloaded it. I've played it a couple of times. I did make one video, but I, the quality was, wasn't that good, guys. Um, the quality of what I was saying and the content of the video. I didn't want to put out anything too mediocre for you guys. I'm not a professional YouTuber by any means, but I have a certain standard that I want to put out for you guys. But anyway, um, I believe that in the Battlefield franchise, um, Battlefield 4 was probably the peak of the franchise for me. I know a lot of people think that Battlefield Bad Company is the peak of the franchise, and I completely see where they're coming from. Uh, Battlefield 1 was amazing. It introduced, you know, huge battles, the blimps, the airships, uh, the huge, um, what do you call it, the, uh, the um, naval battles with the big warships. That was absolutely amazing. That raised my excitement for the franchise. Most um, most games that come out, Battlefield games, raise my uh, anticipation for the next game because they get better. Um, I, the only thing that's bad is probably Hardline, but most people don't really care too much about that. Battlefield 5, I've been seeing good things about this. There's been a lot of controversy, you know, with the social justice warriors and stuff, but I'm not going to get into any political stuff on this channel because that's not my sort of style. I'm just here to enjoy the games and the content, not the political side of it. Whether you agree or don't agree, that's fair enough. Battlefield 5 has always been about the big scale battles. That's what set, sets it apart from the Call of Duty franchise and other franchises that are similar. So anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to jump in and see um, see what this game has in store for us. Obviously, I know that this is not the, the full game, so we're going to go on Grand Operations to start off with. Yeah, I know this isn't the full game, guys. This is a beta. This is a sample of what's coming out in the game. Most of the time, betas, they have sort of like 90% represent the full game, I would say. So it's going to be pretty similar. There might be a few tweaks here and there, but the game's probably going to be very, very similar to what we're seeing here. Uh, from what I've been seeing on YouTube, guys, a lot of people complaining about this, that the maps aren't big enough. Um, the scale of, the, you know, the scale of the maps, the scale of the gunfights just aren't big enough to support. World War II should be on a grand scale. It should be huge massive. There should be tanks, aircrafts infantry everywhere but apparently the maps are really small uh people just aren't happy with the way that the you know the maps are working for them but i think people need to just you know just hold the brakes because this is a beta there's only two maps that have been released not all the guns and content has been released we need to get the full game and then we need to make our opinions out i do get people making an informed opinion about the beta that's fair enough um they want to make early opinions on the game We'll be I'm not gonna let I'm not gonna let YouTubers sway my opinion. Landing. I have my own opinions on uh, you know, the game, so try and think for myself, as ready. opposed to being what told to think. But anyway, guys, that's enough of me rambling. Let's get into this game and see what we do. Seeing as I'm wearing my sniper T-shirt, I'm gonna try and play as a sniper, even though I'm so bad. So here we go. This is gonna end really badly. Sorry, by the way, guys, if I'm looking over this direction, I'm playing on my TV because uh, my screen's a little bit out of sync with my TV, so trying to play it accurately on my PC screen's just not going to work. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and head for A. Although I did hear about the building mechanic where you can build sandbags up and stuff, so that sounds pretty cool. That'd be an interesting mechanic to put into this game. Well, we're all bunching up. That's never a good thing. Never bunch up together, guys. Come on. If any of you guys are playing this game or have played the beta, jump into the comment section. Let me know what you think about it. What was your favourite class? What are the things you didn't like? What are you hoping to see in the full game? Please let me know. I'm really interested to find out what you guys think. Trying to talk and play a game at the same time is not one of my skills, but I'm going to try the best for you guys. By the way, guys, make sure you go on my YouTube channel. I've just uploaded a load of Spider-Man videos for the latest Spider-Man game. I'm up to uh, part six in the series. I'm going to be doing the whole game, so make sure you check that out, guys. Oh, uh, you have to zoom out for it to, to... Oh, I was gonna go around and shoot him. I just saw, I swear I just saw someone. Did I just see someone? Well. An explosive has been acquired. I hate the cross sight. I hate the cre I hate the T cross sight on these scopes. I'm really bad. Ah, no. I told you guys, I'm so bad. I'm so bad. Especially, I haven't played Battlefield for quite a long time. Well, I did say I have played this game. You know, I have played the beta, but I played it the other day. I got in from work. I played it for 20 minutes. Um, I was very tired, like I am now. But, yeah, I just wanted to play this game for you guys. While the beta's open, I had to play it. Do a little bit of content for you guys. Just show, show some of the game if you haven't seen it yet. And I wanted to let you guys know what my thoughts and opinions were on this game. 
I will say though, on a 4K HDR TV, the graphics just look incredible. Uh, deploy overview. So there's two options. You can spawn on your guys, or you can uh, go to the overview. And I like the concept of being able to parachute out of these planes. That's pretty awesome. Geronimo! Reminds me of like um, Metabona Airborne. A game that hardly anyone ever talks about anymore because the franchise like disappeared. Got him! Got him! Haha! <laughs> Sniper! <laughs> there was me gloating that I just killed someone and then I just get sniper, like counter snipered me. Like what's the chances? Come on. That's what happened. This is what happens when you're too cocky playing games. <laughs> Guys, if anything, checking out this video just to see that. Me getting my ass handed to me, that was worth it. I'm gonna uh Okay, I'm gonna play the sniper a couple more. I'm gonna play the sniper like one or two more times, guys, and then I'm gonna switch to the assault class because uh try and get some more kills with the uh, the deploy point is no alright, yeah, because obviously the planes go past the deploy point. Well, there's a guy right there. Wow, I can't believe I actually just hit him. Well, quick get some cover. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? He was behind us. There was a guy who managed to get behind us. Okay. Assault class. Assault class is for when you mean business. Uh, okay, I'm going to go into the middle plane. Right, at the end of the video, guys, I'll give you my thoughts and opinions on what I think of the game. I'm not going to do it just yet. Because obviously, I still haven't seen the entire map. So. Let's go. Such a cool idea being a paratrooper. Every little kid stream being a paratrooper. <laughs> Is that enemies right there? <laughs> and that is the reason why I'd never be a good paratrooper, because I would just jump straight into the enemies and die. <laughs> what not to do. I'm going to be a little bit more conservative now, guys. I'm going to try and, like, jump back into where my teammates are and then try and push forward rather than trying to parachute into them. Okay. Uh, right. That's what we're going to do here, then. Let's go for the middle plane again. Right. Let's try and jump into my own part, the own part of the map that we actually have. I'm going to head for... Uh, okay, I'm just doing the same thing I did last time. I'm not even sure what the gr grenade button is. It is it L1, R1. Oh crap! I killed one of them. I'm happy about that, guys. Come on, I'm really bad. <laughs> shooting games, uh, I love shooting games, and I'm great when I get stuck in, but it's kind of like, yeah. Don't expect too much out of me, yeah. I really want to know what you guys have think of this. I'm so interested, because like, I come across YouTube videos of this game all the time, and like Call of Duty videos. And um, they always amaze me of what people come up with, like the ideas, their opinions, their thoughts. They, they think of things that I would never think of to look at when I look at these betas. So if you guys have any thoughts or outside of the box comments or, you know, if you've played it for hours and there's just things that are kind of niggling away at you that you're not sure about this game, just jump into the comment section and let me know because I really want to hear what you guys are thinking about this game. Some people are loving it, some people are hating it, some people are saying it's a, it's a Call of Duty clone, so... But anyway, guys, I'm going to try and talk less and get more into the action. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Apparently not. This defending team's kicking our ass at the moment. <laughs> well, they're kicking my ass, anyway. Oh, some guy's handgunning it. He's being brave. That deserves a squad spawn. Okay. Okay, hopefully we can get some good defense around here. Where's the enemy coming from? That's where we came from. Yeah, take that. Headshot bonus. Nice, nice, nice. There's 
a guy right there. There's a guy right there. Ah, oh, he stole my kill. Okay, I'm going to back it up because there's a lot of enemy fire coming in from that direction. Nah, you tried it. He, whoa. He tried it. He tried handgunning me, but he... I was just about to say, he tried handgunning me and he didn't get away with it. But then his mate came around and did the same thing, so... Ah, tricky people. Let's try the medic class. I've only just realised that I'm the British. You can't see it because my camera's in blocking the British sign. It's like, it's around about here on the screen. But I didn't actually realise that, which is quite weird. Can we not spawn in anywhere apart from on these planes? Hmm. Can I not spawn on the ground anywhere? Guys, imagine doing this in real life. How nuts would that be? Alright, jump! Okay, so it looks like we've captured... We captured CD. We've got to capture CD and something else. CD and B. Oh, we've got a little Sten gun. I love the Sten gun. It's probably my fa favourite World War II gun. What other weapons have we got? Ah, uh, wrong button. Smoke grenade thrown! Okay, we got a smoke grenade. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I hit him. Nice one. Yes, got him. Nice, nice. Ah, oh, I was taking on too many of them. I got, I got a few of them, so I was happy with that. But they, they just kept coming over that hill. There was no way that, there was no way that I could defend against all of them, especially with that Sten gun, because it doesn't have the biggest magazine on it either. All right, guys, I'm gonna go for the light machine gun class. I want to try and get a bit of each class, so I can get a bit of a fill for each class. This isn't going to be the most in-depth, longest video, by the way, guys, because I'm not the most professional YouTuber in the way that I do things. But, like, I'm just trying to make a basic kind of understanding of this video. I just want to put out a little bit of content on this game for you guys. <coughs> just want to play it a bit myself as well, just so I can get a bit of a... I just want to get a bit of an understanding of the game as well before I play it. And if it helps any of you guys get a better understanding before you, uh, before you feel like you want to purchase the full game... Maybe this game will change your mind. I'm not really. Maybe this video will change your mind on whether you want to purchase the full game when it comes out, or maybe you want to wait a bit for it to come out and then it go down in price. It's up to you guys. But we can't let it pass without playing it. That's for sure. <coughs> okay. Yes. Support suppression. Nice one. It's got quite a big recoil. It's got quite a big kick on this gun, though. That's the one thing I will say. There's a guy over there making a lot of racket. I was going to go... <coughs> I was going to run up to that tower and try and fire a mo throw a Molotov, co Molotov cocktail on top of it and try and take him out, but... <coughs> Someone obviously saw me before I got there. But I don't like that light machine gun, guys. It's uh, it's very... Um, it's very kind of all over the place. Oh, let's go in here. <coughs> oh, we got snipers. I'm just going to... I'm just going to aimlessly run about and just try and kill as many people as I can. <coughs> I do apologise for the coughing, guys. I've just got over a cold. I was bedridden a couple of days ago because I had such a bad cold. But I'm really determined to get on here and make some good videos for you guys. Well, good subjective. It's a subjective thing. You might think my videos are crap, but it's up to you guys. You obviously don't think they're that crap because if you're here watching this, then it can't be that crap, can it? But, um... Whoa! You can squad spawn when they're like halfway through their drop. That's pretty cool. 
Okay, so we want to... Ah, we need to grab the bomb. Let's go and grab a bomb. No. An explosive located near your position. Just automatically walk over it to pick it up. Okay. I walked over it, so do I have an explosive now? I, I should have an explosive. Smoke bomb. Have a smoke grenade. Right in the face. Have some of that. Oh, he's right there. What? Where did that come from? Oh, he was in the pillbox. What I'm going to do, guys, in a minute as well, I'm going to try and back out of this and I'm going to try and go on, because I know there's two maps on this beta, so I want to play both maps for you guys so you can just get a, a kind of a feel for what uh, for what's on this beta. I'll have two more lives on this map and then I'll swap to the next map for you guys. Right, let's go back to the assault class. Spawn on this guy. He's right in the thick of the action, this guy. I love that. When you pop over the hill and there's a guy just stood there, and you just mow him down. Such a... Have a grenade! Right, we need some health. Quick, go and throw. Wait. We lost that so bad. So bad. They were a really good defensive team. Grand Operation Defeat. Objective is destroyed. One. The Germans' successful defense gave them time to prepare, and they're readying a significant resistance on shore. We are one step closer to liberating Narvik. We won't be winning by the numbers, so it's got to be grit that sees us through. I like it. I like the map. I think it's pretty nice. It'd be nice if they expanded it a bit, added some more vehicles, added some vehicles into it and stuff like that. That'd be pretty cool. British, la British forces land in Navar. The future of Norway rests in the narrow strip of shoreline. Inland, the wor Wormark prepare an attack for the British the battle the battle for Narvik started for the Germans the fight has not yet begun day two all right guys what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go out of this one I'm gonna go on to the other map so you guys can see that one that's a bit loads be steadfast troops once we've taken back this harbour, the Kriegsmarine will be bloody well sunk. Oh, okay, we're moving into... And capture each garrison using whatever resources remain. We're moving into the next you part of the map now, so... Finest, and the enemy are going to find out exactly what that means. I'm going to do two videos, guys. I'm going to do one video on this map, because there's two parts of this map, and then I'll do a video on the... I'll do a video on the other map with, the, with uh, showing both parts of that as well, because I want to show you guys the whole thing. Okay, so I'm gonna go as a sniper. I wanna be a sniper. By the way guys, if you think I'm just rambling nonsense most of the time, just avoid just just enjoy the video rather than listening to me. I don't know. <laughs> I just say whatever comes into my head and hopefully it sounds good. I don't know. A YouTuber's dream, hey? Whoa! Stop shooting at me, you're trying to kill me or what? There's a guy right there, there's a guy right there. I just saw him, where did he go? Hey, there's a little Amtrak, that's pretty cool. Oh, right in the back. Brutal. Did I get in the house? I don't even know where I'm going, guys. I'm literally just running around, hoping that I head in the right direction. There's loads of them over there. Yeah, so him. No, that was crap. He's trying to hit me. He's trying to hit me.
Yes, I'm hitting him. Oh! <laughs> I gotta give it to him. That was good. That was good. That was such a good sniper position right there. Out of that window, you could see you could see the railroad, and there were so many of them on there. If I was actually good, I probably could have got loads of kills then. But I'm terrible, so what are you gonna do? Right, they spawn on this guy. Come on, mate. We're gonna get you. Let's go. Squad revive. Oh, 250 points for a squad revive. That's pretty good. Oh, almost had him. Almost had him. Yes. Defensive kill, defensive kill, counter sniping. That was great. Right, right. Here we go, here we go, here we go. My head's about to get blasted off, I reckon. I swear there was a guy there. That guy's just moving from side to side. Bye bye, you're dead. Oh, almost had him. Almost had him. Yeah. See how many points I got then? Was that a double kill? I think that was a double kill. Well, wow, that guy just got messed up. I see him spawning in. Where did he go? I saw a guy moving. I'm getting shot from behind. Where did he go? Where did he go? Sector taken, boss. Sector is ours. We must clear the enemies from this sector. Open the door. There's a guy. Oh, I was going to stab him. He didn't give me the chance. I've got some good sniper kills there, though. This bleed out thing gets a bit tedious sometimes, but it's not too bad. I'm quite enjoying the sniper, so I'm going to play as a sniper for a little bit longer, guys. I know it's the hip thing to do. Whoa! Right, that's it. I'm going to try and get a grenade down there. If I can get a grenade down there. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I fell through the bridge. Did not mean to do that. Attack the next sector now. All right. Chill out, bruv. Where are they? Where are they? How did that not kill him? Oh, my teammate must have killed him before I shot. Grenade! That's a grenade! Whoa! That was close. They've got us, they got us pinned down. Didn't think that would work. Just run around the back. Stab. <laughs> that was cool. How did he not see me? I'm, sh I'm sure he just ran straight past me. I 
I've got to give it to him, mate. The graphics look amazing on this game. What? I don't even know. That looked like two bodies, like, doing something weird. There was, like, two bodies, like, like, like wobbling about on each other like this. <laughs> that looked really weird. I've seen that really cool YouTube clip where that guy gets headshot by a sniper and then his body kind of just like floats down the road and it looks really creepy. Look up floating body Battlefield 5. It should come up on YouTube. We don't seem to be doing so very successful at this, uh, this loading bay though. They've got us pinned down with sniper. Over the top, grenade! Grenade from! Got him! Oh man! It was like whack a mole, it was like up and down, like up, fire, up, fire. <laughs> Trying to like bob around all over the place. What's this guy doing? I love these like little miniature tanks you can like drive along with the, like, the tracks on them. They're, they're really cool. Spawn on this guy. I'm gonna head over to the village because I haven't been I haven't been into the village. Although it's probably not a good idea to head into the village with the sniper rifle. Um, I'll try and sort of stay on the outskirts and then when I get killed on the next step I'll go to the assault class. I'm going to try and pick them off from the side. Um, they're trying to get B if I try and pick them off from the side. Give our guys a bit of breathing space. There he is, there he is, there he is. We are losing Hit him. Able. And picked him off. See, they're trying to get B. If I can pick them off from down here. Ah. No, they've seen me. Nice one. Right, this is going to be bad. CQB with the sniper rifle class. Objective able is lost. Grenade for him. What? <laughs> I was pressing the fire button, but it kept jabbing the knife. I don't even know what was going on. This guy was just like pointing his knife at me, and then he killed me. That was so funny. Classic. This is what I love about Battlefield. We will get one more objective in this sector, apparently. Well. Wasn't expecting to get him out of that. Oh, come on. We just stabby, stabby, stabby. I got this fascination with, like, stabbing people. <laughs> Sounds really bad, but... I don't know. I think it's just, like, a gloating thing, isn't it? Like, when you're in Battlefield, when you get the opportunity to, like, stab someone, you just... Oh, we got a tank there. Look at the size of that. Pretty cool. Cook it, cook it, cook it. Fro. Yes, we got him. Nice. What the? Whoa. Yes! I actually got him this time. We nearly have the sector. Yes. Aww. I'm happy though because I got that melee kill. That was great. That tank is just like... There's buildings and the tank's just like plowing through them. It's crazy. You never see that in any other games. Mother. It's pretty weird though because you have a medic class in this game, yet any player can now 
revive another player. So the medic class is kind of a bit pointless in some respects. Um, you can heal yourself, I think, being the medic class. I'm not particularly sure. Um, but I don't really get it. I don't know why I'm still playing as a sniper. There's a vehicle there. Got him. Have a grenade. Holy crap. Is that a, is that a tiger? I think that was a tiger. Stay away from that. Oh, no way. That was a cracking headshot. Whoa. Gonna ride the back of this tank. Cause why not? That didn't end well. <laughs> I wasn't expecting. What? The tiger. I think that was a tiger. If I, I think it's a tiger. I'm not sure. But like, I was on the back of my tank, and the tiger comes around the corner and just like destroys me. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go deploy. I'm going to have another crack at the... Hmm. Yeah, let's go Assault class again. I was hoping I would get an after kill because I threw a grenade. Oh, I got 23 points. I'll take it. I was going to say, I, I threw my grenade over there and I was hoping I would get an after kill, but... 23 points, take it. Those tanks, though. When you come out of a building, you see that tank coming towards you, like... <laughs> We're right inside the enemy base now. Shots. What was that? Someone take him out. Oh man, I think there was two of them in that. I didn't realise. I thought he was going to hide it. I was going to burst through the front door and then try and knife him, but didn't quite work out the way I wanted it to. Mate, you need to launch a grenade over there. Come on. Can't spawn because he's under fire. There we go. I think there was enemy in there as well. hit in the corner like the whole roof just collapsed like how can he still be alive I'm not sure how much longer of this uh, match there is guys but I'm gonna keep playing hopefully you guys are still in still sticking around thanks if you are still sticking around if you are still stuck around thanks for watching I hope you guys are enjoying as before jump in the comment section let me know what you think um, if you hate this game, if you think it looks good, if you're going to pick it up on release day, if you're going to buy the DLC, uh, or is there a DLC pack? I'm not sure. Don't hold me to that, guys. I haven't done my research on that one. Are they doing a free season pass like they are with um, Battlefront 2? I'm not really sure how it's working. <laughs> okay, so where are we at the moment? Um... Oh, can I get in a tank, please? I'm in a tank. <laughs> okay. Do you have any kind of machine guns or is it just uh no. Awesome. 
I'm probably gonna get blown up straight away. What was that? What? That sounded so weird, whatever that was. Okay, back it up, 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 back it up. Random shot. Sometimes it works. I'm just gonna head for A and then see if I can find anyone to take out. Enemies, enemies, enemy players. Oh no! I went over some like weird terrain and I like, couldn't do anything. I'm coming for you. I'm gonna run you over. <laughs> this is just, I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm literally just running into their base and just trying to run them all over. Because I can't hit them, I'm gonna try and run them over. Ah, there's a post right there. What? Is that another tank? Bell up, bell up, bell up. How do I get out? so bad anyway guys i'm gonna have two more lives and then i'm gonna end the video there because otherwise it'll go on well too long for you guys we've played all the classes though and um, we've played a, a vehicle class as well now so that's pretty cool i'm not sure if they still do the same thing like on battle on battlefield one where if you um spawning a vehicle you become a driver so you have like a mechanics tool and uh, a certain type of rifle and things like that i'm not really sure that's something i'm gonna have to find out Okay, this is a small little room. How do I close the door? Uh, I'm just like inside the enemy base in a little hut. Hello? What was that? Like someone like making weird noises. How about sucker? I don't want to stay in here too long because they're going to find out where I am. I'm just going to run around that base. This is going to be a great way to end this video. There's a tank just sat on the hill. There's a tank. I think there's a tank just sat on the hill. And there's loads of guys around it and they're all just firing off the top of that hill. I need like an RPG or something. Right guys, this is going to be my final life and then I'm going to wrap up the video. Here we go, final life. Hopefully it's something good. What the? He just did like a spin of Rooney. I bet guarantee I'm gonna get killed by the first person I see now. Because I said it's my final life, it's gonna be like really under dramatic. Yeah, these are the these are the constructions I think that you can uh, set up. Pretty cool mechanic, I think. Oh, that tank seems to have gone. I'm running in here. I have no idea where I'm going. I'm literally just running around. Have a grenade. Throwing grenade out. Hit someone. Run away. <laughs> guy right there. There's a guy right there. I just saw him. Got him. Come on. Oh. Anyway, guys, that was my last death. So far, guys, I'm going to say that I really, really like 
this game, what they've done with it, like it feels really smooth. The weapons, like the way that the characters move, the vaulting through the windows, going through the doors, everything feels really smooth and really nice. Um, but yeah, I can see what they mean by like the maps seem a lot more confined. They seem a lot more kind of compact, like CQB, like. And if you get one vehicle on each team rather than several vehicles, um, it makes the war aspect seem a little bit smaller, a little bit kind of more compact. That's not necessarily a bad thing. Um, the moment-to-moment -moment gunplay is still like really good, really fresh and exciting. It's still awesome. Um, the grenade explosions seem kind of um, revamped. It seems a lot more kind of uh, forceful when you throw a grenade. Um, I'm really liking what they're showing with this beta so far. I'm going to play the other map. I'm going to upload a video of that as well, guys. Um, that's if I've got time, so don't hold me to that. If I haven't got time, um, then I won't be able to. But um, I'm really liking it. So far, out of 10, I'd probably give it... At the moment, I'm going to give it a 7. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10, which is a solid score. 5 is average, so 7 is really solid. Um, the graphics are amazing. The gameplay is amazing. The mechanics, um, setting up the sandbags, everything like that. Ramming through the buildings with tanks. It's still a classic Battlefield game. Um, thanks for watching this video, guys. And um, I hope you stick around for more content on this channel. See ya.